Hey, it's Craig, that fast food guy. Welcome to that fast food guy, fast food reviews. I'll give you a little bit of history. We'll review some fast food. It's going to be a lot of fun. And no, I don't wear a suit. I don't think that's that big of a deal. Hey, it's Craig. Welcome back to That Fast Food Guy. You can find us on Facebook at That Fast Food Guy. You can also find us on Twitter, That Fast Food Guy, and of course the YouTube channel. If you like what you see, subscribe, hit the bell, get notifications. We're going to post videos usually four or five a week. Sometimes on Tuesdays you'll see two videos. That's right, two. Two for Tuesday. You'll get a breakfast video and a lunch or dinner video. Plus, on Thursdays, it's Throwback Thursday. I'll review classic items from fast food restaurants all across the country. Today, we delve into something new from KFC, their secret recipe fries. Now, if you're like my son, you loved potato wedges at KFC. Well, somebody decided halfway through 2020, there's a pandemic going on. Why don't we get rid of fat potato wedges and start making French fries with our 11 herbs and spices on them? So that's what they decided to do. Little bit of history, Kentucky Fried Chicken started with Colonel Sanders back in the 40s. He started making chicken at his place in Harlan, Kentucky. Eventually, the interstate passed him by. He had to close down his, his restaurant there, and he decided to start going door-to-door -to, -door to restaurants and selling his chicken. He got a nickel for every piece of chicken with his secret 11 herbs and spices that were also made in his pressure cooker. Now that doesn't sound like much, but after a while, five, 600 restaurants each selling about a thousand pieces of chicken a week, and pretty soon Colonel Sanders was making some money. Finally, in the 1960s, 1964 to be exact, he sold his secret herbs and spices, his secret recipe for fast food fried chicken for $4 million. They decided to keep him on as a spokesman, so you see Colonel Sanders on TV commercials right up until he died in 1980. But at that time, the people who bought the recipe also bought the recipe for his mashed potatoes and gravy and his biscuits, and they decided to start making restaurants. Next thing you know, there's 4,000 KFCs in the world, and it's the most popular fast food chicken restaurant. So today we are at KFC. You can see right behind me, we're at KFC. We're trying secret recipe fries. Supposedly these fries are sprinkled with the 11 herbs and spices that the Kentucky Fried Chicken original recipe chicken has on it. Uh, they look to be kind of a little thicker of a fry. Not your typical like a McDonald's really thin fast fry, fast food fry, but also not as thick as say a Burger King fast food fry. So somewhere kind of in the middle. They come in this small box. This is the individual size for at my local KFC, almost $3. Uh, you can get a bigger one. It's a bigger box, probably for about $4.99. So let's see. Let's see. Well, it doesn't smell like the chicken, but let's see what it tastes like. Um, I mean, they're all right. They kind of remind me of a French fry maybe you'd make at home, like in a bag. There's no real discernible extra different taste to them. They taste just like regular french fries. That one's a little more burnt. They taste a little saltier. I guess maybe someday I'll have to do a review where we actually take a piece of original recipe chicken and one of these and eat them side by side and see if you can taste the difference. I really can't taste the difference between this and just a regular french fry. Mm, the fries are a little tough. I like my fries to be a little softer. For three bucks, would I get them again? You know, they've got a special going on right now where you get like a three-piece tender meal with the fries for like $5.49. I might get them in that, but I don't know if I would ever get them just separate by themselves. Well, they're not bad. Are they better than the potato wedges? I personally didn't like the potato wedges, so I would probably be more apt to get these. But I would also be more apt to just go across the street to McDonald's and get a large order of fries there. KFC secret recipe fries with 11 herbs and spices, so they say, which is a company secret held in a vault at the Yum Brands World Headquarters in Louisville, Kentucky. Supposedly only like five or six people in the world know what the 11 secret herbs and spices are. 
you can go on the internet and you can find plenty of people who can tell you what the 11 herbs and spices are. They've dissected it. In, I think it's MSG and salt and a couple of other. There's not a, there's not technically 11, but so there you go. KFC. Original recipe fries. And of course the Colonel's now delivering. So maybe Colonel Sanders will deliver your French fries to you if he comes back from the dead. Hey, it's Craig, that fast food guy. Remember, subscribe, like us, ding the bell, like us on Facebook, follow on Twitter for all the fast food reviews. Thanks for watching.